So let's talk about the image gallery. Really all it ends up being is extra clip art. It's only available with XMind Plus, XMind Pro, or an XMind subscription. You're going to find it. It comes with XMind Plus, and it's part of the what they call the creative toolbox. Let's be straight up with this. This isn't a reason. The image gallery isn't a reason why you're going to upgrade to XMind Plus. You're not going to say, look at the cool image gallery. I've got to have this. You're getting it for the other cool features. But let me run through it anyway, and I'll show you some of the neat things you can do with it. Now, to get into the image gallery, it's very simple. There are two ways you can do it. One is you can go to the Insert menu. Choose image, and you can see from clip art. It's just extra clip art. I'll run through. You can see there are the hats, some office stuff. I'll run through some couple animals. I'll try and pause so you can have a quick look at some of the stuff. They got some neat things. I wouldn't say there's a ton. I didn't actually go through and count them individually, but there's dozens of them. Cake, kids. There's a women's one, a sports one next. Weather. So there's quite a few options, right? and Christmas and one more Halloween pirate there you go the other way to get into it is just off the toolbar so you can see that there is an image you can click the image or just hit the down arrow next to it and you can choose again file web clip art so again this is the clip art section of it that's pretty much it once we get it you can see I have this this is my current node that I have selected so I can go in and let's just say let's pick something here that I can that I can use how about a nice slice of cake? Well, we'll go with a slice of cake. And all you need to do is simply, there are two ways you can get into it. One is you can double click, and boom, we're good to go. Or you can do, obviously you can drag and drop. So if you want, we can head back in from clip art, go find something else. We're like, oh, this is a nice one too. I can drag drag it and drop it to wherever I want to put it. So I can, if I want image gallery, I'll throw it around the image gallery. There we go. You can see also that when it's selected, you can go ahead and just resize this to whatever size you do need. So there you go, the image gallery. If you found this video useful, get the cheat sheet. It's an XMind workbook filled with tutorials, videos, and links, and all sorts of cool stuff. Imagine that, using XMind to help you use XMind. You can get it by following the link below. All I ask in exchange is that you give my newsletter a chance. Thanks for watching.